So Steve, the story with him, I think my boy, uh, my boy Matt, who ran the full send IG. Okay. Um, I think he sent me, or Lucas, or both of them, they sent me like a video of Steve, and he was chugging Jack Daniels <laughs> on his driveway, like like a full That's disgusting. I think bro. it was like a two six. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it's disgusting. Like what? Yeah, yeah. yeah like crazy. I saw that, and he's just on his driveway, and he just pounds the whole two six, and I was like. <laughs> I've never seen that in my <laughs> fucking life. Bro, like, he's crazy, what dude. the fuck? So I'm like looking at all his videos and he's like chugging. But the liquor slams were one that I was like, I don't yeah. like this yeah. is not computing in my yeah, fucking I can't head. Yeah. This. So yeah, that's yeah. the thing with me. It's like it's not that hard to find talent. Like if I like someone, I feel like everyone else is going to like them. Yeah. That's the way I see it. Yeah. yeah. So I saw Steve. So I, I reached out to him and I think I just I think I just posted him. Yeah, I posted mm -hmm. him. And then I think he says I got him to a thousand followers, and then we just kept staying in touch. And then uh, we would have our Rona season shirts. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So I asked him, I was like, "Yo, would you be down to do a video in like the Rona season shirt?" And he said, "Yeah, sure." So I paid him some money. I like shipped him a shirt to wear the Rona season shirt. Yeah. And then he like drank like ten Coronas <laughs> in the shirt. Crazy dude. <laughs> Crazy. You guys insane. I think he's so, some fucked up shit. That guy, man. Yeah. And then I met him. Uh, <laughs> I went, we were in Orlando filming one time. Okay. And that's where Steve lives, Oviedo. Mm -hmm. So I just hit him up. I was like, yo, like, you want to chill? Like, I'll come meet you and shit. So me and Nino went there. And like, this guy was just living in like a shitty three, like two, three bedroom apartment. Like, he that's had like an adopted crazy. pit bull with like three roommates. Jesus. They're just like fucking gaming, like smoking weed and shit. Holy like it was like fuck. we filmed it too. I want to try to find the footage somewhere. Yeah, yeah like yeah. it was a different Steve. Like it Damn. was crazy. And we went out to his local bar, the okay. Knights Library. Holy and like fuck. Steve just got trashed. <laughs> That's crazy. Like and he's so fuck. funny too. Like he goes like he's wearing like a regular shirt and then he goes to his room and changes and comes back in like this tight like Batman shirt. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like just throws on like a Batman shirt. We go to the bar and then he like blacks the fuck out like <laughs> why not so funny and then uh the next day he texted me he's like yo sorry bro like i blacked out like i just woke <laughs> up in my batman shirt like i don't even remember what happened like he's like there's like six shotgun cans in my sink like i don't know what happened i'm like dude that was you that drank those like <laughs> Jesus but yeah that, that was my first time meeting him and he was like so funny so then I, when i met him i was like Okay, this guy's just like funny. Yeah. Mm. Like this guy's fucking hilarious. Like he's a complete character. Yeah. You know, just everything he does besides the drinking, like he's also just like very funny. Yeah. Or you see it, you see it yeah. in the vids. So we just kept in touch and like kept we kept paying him to do shit. And mm -hmm. he was down. He's like, hell yeah. Like he was happy to get paid to like wear full send, rep full send. Sick. And then I think we went back to Florida and then we did like some videos like smoking and lectures. <laughs> yeah. And like he chugged out of a frat guy's like amputated leg. Or the leg, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and then eventually he just moved to the cloud house with us. Right on, okay. And we just because dude, he's Steve like, will do it, man. He's, like, he's a fucking like animal. He's, he's fucking huge, massive, dude, massive. I mean, like, yeah, that's that's why I'm so impressed. And like, don't get me wrong, you see, he puts the work in. You, you see what goes on, but bro, he's a very me, hard worker, though, dude. But so like, one 100%. thing with Steve is like he's like honestly probably just as hard as worker as me, maybe like yeah. Like he's vi like guys not doesn't make excuses, you know. Yeah. You like see he's it. He's very hard worker. But dude, and he he is very smart too. You found that. Like you yeah, see what I'm trying to say? Like, wrong. man, there's 300 million people here, bro, in this fucking country. Like, mm -hmm. for you to find him at that level, and see where he is today, like it's are, pretty crazy. What are we you, did? Are he you started his channel? Yeah. He wanted to do. He was just doing Instagram, right? Yeah. So I would help him run his Instagram, and then when we started his YouTube. Like, we came up with the whole strategy. We said, you're going to do two videos a week. Okay. We chose the days. We repped it. Like, we promoted it. And then uh, I would help him with his titles and thumbnails every week. And, like, yeah, just get him going. Got him going. And we yeah. got him to a million subs in, like, 29 days. You guys used to say the yeah. fastest guy to a million fastest subs. Yeah. yeah, right? Crazy. A How million in a month. That's, like, almost That's unheard yeah. of, bro. Jesus yeah. Christ. Because YouTube is very hard to grow. Bro, we're at, like, Especially 100 now. episodes begging to get 2000 all year i understand that believe me how does it feel to like bring so many people up like i love it you've been doing yeah. it for like it. 10 years dude, when now. i see talented people like it brings me joy to like yeah, yeah. it gets me excited because i'm like yo like you guys could be big mm. like, you yeah. know that like mm -hmm. so like when i see it i like doing it you know it benefits us too to bring someone on but i'm sure. just like i'm like yo you could be big. like yeah. i love seeing them grow 
that must be like that must be like it's really dope. Yeah, the, the, like, yeah, to be honest, like I'm to saying. see that happen, to watch him, fuck man, unreal. It's fun. It's fun like finding people, and like yeah, I saw some other guy on TikTok the other day too, and I like I reached out to him, I called mm. him, and like they're doing pretty good too. Yeah. But I'm like, yo, like are you doing anything? Like they're like, nah. Like he's like, I'm working this like garbage job right now. I'm like, fuck, dude. Um, like you know, yeah. I think some people just don't want to go for it or they don't realize what they have. But then they see a message from you and they're like, all right, yeah, <laughs> right, maybe it's time to go. Yeah, <laughs> They just <laughs> need a little guidance go. and they need to know how to like, it is tough to make money at the beginning. Mm -hmm. No, for sure. But I think hearing it from you too, like you can do something super inspiring to them. Are you yeah. still to this day looking for talent? Oh, Are you yeah. always looking? I mean, that, that's one of our goals this year is like to really build out a whole network and talent.